Well, history has been made in Cuyahoga County. This is a fascinating story. Look at that picture there. The Cleveland Metro Parks captured images of the first bobcat spotted in the county since 1850. That's it, 170 years ago. That's just the first one that's been spotted. Right. And the bobcat pictures were captured on wildlife cameras run by the Metro Parks. Our Neil Fisher spoke with a wildlife ecologist earlier today about this, joins us now. They've got to be ecstatic about this. As a resident of Cuyahoga County, though, you may be going, Whoa, what does this mean for me? <laughs> I think a lot of people, because it's a recreation site for a lot of folks here in Northeast Ohio, but this Bobcat has been spotted twice in the Metro Parks on their cameras in the last five months, once in July and again in October. John Sepek joined the Cleveland Metro Parks in 2014, and he started installing wildlife cameras to track what wildlife is actually in the Metro Parks. He told me when he saw the images, he knew right away this was a Bobcat. The Metro Parks won't say where it was discovered, but John says it shouldn't alarm those who use the Metro Parks. Anybody has concerns about, you know, if I'm out, what if it's out there? Well, maybe it is out there, but it's trying to avoid you. And if, if you see it, try to get a picture because you're not going to see it for very long because it's going to do its best to stay away from people and stay in its, its natural habitat. Bobcats have been spotted in other counties surrounding Cuyahoga County, including Summit. But this is the first time it's been recorded to be here in Cuyahoga County since 1850. That's 172 years since a bobcat has been spotted here in Cuyahoga County, and it's a testament to what the Cleveland Metro Parks have done to clean up the land and make it fit a bobcat's lifestyle. We know there's an established population of bobcats in southeast Ohio, so very exciting for us here in northeast Ohio as well. And Betsy, you mentioned it. That was not a pelt from the bobcat here. <laughs> He's that holding was pictured. The pelt and I'm like, that was. <laughs> that's not the bobcat, right? <laughs> no, he said they got that uh, for educational purposes. Right? <laughs> they got it a very safe and I, legal I way as well. Wrong thing. message. Wrong message. <laughs> yeah, I thought the we same apologize. thing. When he was holding it. I'm like, wait a minute. Is that our bobcat? <laughs> that's not um, the one we saw. <laughs> what a beautiful animal. They though. are. It's just incredible how gorgeous that animal is, and yep. you think that it's running around in the metro parks. We don't think of Northeast Ohio as the frontier or anything like that, but we've had black bears in Northeast Ohio, yeah. and, and the bobcat, it's, it's native to this area. And he says a lot of people won't see it, but if you do see it, you better snap a picture quick because yeah. once you see it, it'll take they off want on to you. Get away. Any idea how it got here? Uh, no, it no clue as to yeah, Ohio? It took the bus. So they said the population <laughs> metro. <are> <laughs> They said the population in Southeast Ohio is very large and they can travel a long way, so you never know. But they are wow. in the surrounding areas as well. Summit County has seen a few. Okay. Um, he mentioned that Geauga has seen a few as well. So you never know. It could have come from one of those surrounding counties or maybe potentially Southeast Ohio as well. Very cool. Right. Keep your eye out. Don't be nervous. Let it go away. Yeah, they're more afraid of you than you will be of, yeah. of Clap them. Clap your hands. Yeah.